Today, we will talk about how to start a daycare center with government grants. Let's have a look at the details. Has your passion for serving children and families inspired you to open a daycare center? You know you have the drive, compassion, and know how to give back to your community, but the startup costs can be steep. When opening a daycare center, you might spend anywhere between $10,000 to $50,000 US dollars. Before you reach for your wallet, look into government grants. We'll share some tips on how to pay for your daycare center with a variety of grants. You'll also learn what funds are available to you if you're a non-profit or a for-profit daycare center. The first method is qualifying for grants. Decide if you'll start a for-profit or non-profit center. Most government grants are targeted to 501, C, 3, or non-profit, organizations. If you plan to run a non-profit center, you'll be eligible for federal, state, and private grants, many of which will be tax-exempt. If you decide on a for-profit center, you'll qualify for fewer grants, but you can apply to some organizations, like the MBDA or the SBIR. Make sure you're up to date with your child care center licensing. To obtain your child care center license, attend an orientation, review your state's child care center licensing laws and regulations, and complete an application packet. Calculate how many students your pre-K center serves. Most states that use a funding formula will award a grant amount based on the number of children who require resources and assistance. Write a grant proposal. Include a cover letter that describes your child care center and its mission. Keep your cover letter's language formal and informative and be specific about the funds you're requesting. Share any previous communication you've had with the organization that is offering the grant. The second method is applying for nonprofit grants. Submit an application to the Child Care and Development Fund if you qualify as low income. You'll be eligible if you're a primary caregiver for children under 13. You must be employed or enrolled in a training or education program to support children. File your application for a Head Start grant if your nonprofit center serves all children in your local community. Use the Notice of Funding Opportunity NOFO, locator to find Head Start and Early Head Start grants. Expert panelists will review your application and compare it to a list of evaluation criteria. Apply for a Child Care and Development Block grant if you serve at-risk children. You'll qualify if you follow all state and local requirements for child care centers and if you're complying with health and safety requirements. Contact the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services to ask about applying for a local grant. Submit an application to the Community Facilities Grant Program if you serve a rural area. Collect all receipts for healthy meals and snacks you'll serve at your center to apply for the Child and Adult Care Food Program. The third method is applying for for-profit grants. Register your daycare as a business and obtain your DUNS number to apply for an MBDA grant. To qualify for a grant from the Minority Business Development Agency MBDA, the project you're seeking funding for must be relevant to a current grant announcement. Submit your certification as a small business concern to receive funds. Present a commercialization plan with your proposal. Describe your daycare, the market for it, and the finances it requires. Your application will go through a peer review system that evaluates the scientific findings in your proposal. This review process can take up to eight months. Apply for child care subsidies from the Early Childhood Training and Technical Assistance System and Hashtag 40, ECTA and Hashtag 41. To qualify, your center needs to serve low-income families. Thanks for watching this video. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel if you like our videos.